equal to 3,000 over x or x over 3,000? 3,000 over x. And on your calculator, what do you punch in? 3,000 divided by the sine of 40. All right, and you get a whole lot of feet. Now let's make that in something we can understand. If it's 4,667 feet, how can we find out how many miles that is? Divide by 5,280. It's about nine-tenths of a mile, a little less than a mile away, okay? A little less than a mile away. Now, why would this be important in real life? They need to know when they need to start landing, right? This is used. Okay, but do you think the computers made the programs themselves? No, it took a person to use these calculations to figure it out, okay? So this is how it's used. All right, anybody ever saw the movie? And, and I know we're trying to say they have computers to do that now, but yes, they do, but they're used to not, and a person designed the computers, okay? Um, we were soldiers with Mel Gibson. No, that's not what it was called. Is that what it was called? About the Vietnam War? Okay. Does anybody remember that scene where um, they're under attack in a battle, and this kid that's like 19 or 20 years old has a pencil and paper, and he's trying to figure out the coordinates for the bombers to drop a bomb so that they can put that big rate of fire between them and the enemy to give them some, some time? And he calculates it wrong. You remember that? And what happens? Yeah. They drop the fire bomb on their own men. And then he just realized this is a like 19, 20 year old kid. And he just, you know what he was using? That kind of stuff. And then his sergeant says, recalculate it. Can you imagine being 19, 20 years old in the midst of bullets flying around you? And you just killed a bunch of your men because you calculated it wrong, and now you're being told to do it again. How stressful that would be. Okay. And yes, now we have computers that take care of it. But someone has to put the program together. All right, here is your homework assignment for those of you at home.